seeing your team being successful or, or people being successful from, from your city and stuff is a, a huge motivator. For the second straight season, the Winnipeg Blue Bombers are in the Grey Cup, something the city hasn't seen since the late 80s. And with the recent success of the Winnipeg Blue Bombers, it's sure to have a positive impact on the next generation of young football players in Manitoba. Before 2019, the Bombers held the trophy for the longest Grey Cup drought at 29 years. But on November 24th, 2019, that all changed. The win back in Winnipeg. The Blue Bombers, 2019 Grey Cup champions. Now fast forward to 2021. The Bombers are right back where they left off. Dakota Collegiate head coach Mitchell Harrison says the success of the team has a big impact on young kids. Seeing guys like Nick Densky and Andrew Harris and, and um, you know, Jeff Gray, like local products that have, you know, come through, come through Winnipeg and are now representing is a huge motivator for them. It's like they did it. So it's, it's not impossible. It's definitely, there's a pathway to it. Harrison says his program had 100 kids this past football season, which is the most they've ever had. Like other sports, youth football had to be put on hold during the pandemic, but football Manitoba executive director, Bill Johnson says their winter flag football league, which starts in January is already seeing a record number of players. Football is, uh, it's becoming more and more popular as people see the success the Bombers have. And everyone wants to uh, be part of something that uh, to associate with a winner, if you will. And the Bombers have really done a great job making their product uh, a winner. Johnson says the Bombers have done a really good job keeping local players on the team, something he says makes a big difference for young football players. It's so much easier for a kid to look at a guy and say, I want to be like Nick Dembski than it is to look at a guy down in the States and say, I want to be like uh, Odell Beckham Jr. Because that's not something kid, a kid from Winnipeg relates to really well. So that's, uh, that's a really cool part about it all. Throughout the offseason, the Bombers are involved in a number of programs related to youth and education that Harrison says are having a tremendous impact on young athletes. I'm very happy with what they're doing in the community because um, the last couple of years, like, you know, you can get players out of practices. There's so many different programs that they have running for the community that I don't think a lot of people actually know about. Um, and I think that the, the more and more they do that, the more and more successful uh, the sport will be in the province overall. In Winnipeg, Alex Carpa, City News.